Hello guys, hope you're all doing well. So over here I'm going to be teaching you how to web crawl using Excel on how you can fetch website data onto your Excel. Okay, so first I'm right, let me tell you about the data set I'm working on. I'm working on a movies data set. So basically over here I'm just recording all the movies made in Pakistan in Urdu in tabular form. So I'll be teaching you how to first go on a website. For example, this is a Pakistani film website. Okay, let me first teach you what I did. Okay, Pakistan movies, I just typed it in Google and I went to the most generic web page, which represents majority of everything I'm looking for. So here, these are all movies listed by year. So I was doing 2005. Okay, so all you have to do is click here, copy the link, go to your Excel and, and over here, you're basically mostly on the home page. Go to the data tab, okay, and go to get data next to it from web. I prefer the basic one, but if you want to edit the data further before uploading it onto your Excel sheet, so then you can choose advanced over here, okay. You can get that, okay, that you just have to add parts. If you basically, if I want to add all of the URL parts one by one, then if I want to basically fetch data from multiple uh, links, then I will add them over here one by one, okay? So I'm just doing the basic one to teach you how it's done. So over here, I will paste it and I have to press okay. And it's connecting right now. Make sure your Wi-Fi is working, okay, for this. So, okay, it's basically giving me, I want it, unexpected error, close, still works. Okay, it's done. So basically, it's showing me different parts of the data it can fetch as, ta as tabular, as basically table forms of data. Because look, Excel is a tabular data thing. So it can only fetch data in table form. So if you have table forms anywhere in your website, it will just fetch them directly, like it's fetched them over here. You can see the web view as well. So this is the web view of the data it's fetched from tables. Okay, and these are the remaining sections of it. Example here. Okay, table view, like here. Okay, so I will choose, since I want the data like this, I will choose here, load, but if I want to transform the data like further, edit it before I upload it onto my Excel sheet, then I will click here. But I'll just click directly load. You can also load, if you want to basically save it in one of the tabs here, then you will check load too, but I will just press load. And here, tada, it's done. Hope it helps and keep and subscribe over here for more information.